Welcome back to my channel, everybody. My name is Lauren. For those of you who don't know me and for those who know me, you know me. Every single day in every single video, we are talking about how we can harvest our health and not just the health and the wealth that we have in our minds, but also the health and wealth we have in our bodies and in our pockets and in our cells and in our physical world. As we know, the more greatness that we put into our body, the more greatness we will get out of our body. anemia, iron deficiency, and what we can do about it. So the question is, what is anemia? Anemia is what happens to your body when it has a low red blood cell count. So when our bodies have a low red blood cell count, we can experience things like fatigue or um, unexplained shortness of breath or unexplained weakness, cold limbs, we bruise easily. And the reason why we could have low levels of red blood cells is we can just inherently have low hemoglobin. We can have hemoglobin that's broken and doesn't necessarily work the right way anymore. We can also have a low red blood cell count as a whole. Our body could break down our red blood cells too fast, also causing a low red blood cell count. And it can also be linked to more genetic things like sickle cell. Where does it come from? Why do we have a low red blood cell count in the first place? Knowing the cause of why is what's gonna help us fix the issue. No matter what though, there are a couple main things that we want to do immediately. One is up our iron intake and two is up our vitamin C intake. The reason why we want to up our iron intake is because iron is the components of the red blood cells. So the more iron that we have in our body, the more red blood cells we're also going to have. We use vitamin C is because we want to help the iron absorb the very best that it can in our body. More iron for the red blood cells and ultra absorption. Low iron is the reason anemia is a thing in your life in the first place. Some of you might remember my previous story about Vinny. He was anemic. I had a very simple fix for him. I fed him oatmeal and I gave him some orange juice with the oatmeal. The oatmeal was high in the iron, plus I added things to it that is also high in iron, um, like different nuts and seeds. And sometimes I even put oranges into the oatmeal for the vitamin C, or I always gave him a glass of orange juice with the oatmeal to help the absorption of the iron get into the cells better. <laughs> know how low iron is associated in our body how it happens and what we can do about it let's focus specifically on the foods and put together some combinations to where we can eat delicious food for our iron development our tomatoes prunes mulberries olives watermelon believe it or not raisins dried apricots and ripe jackfruit just to break it down for you guys males need eight milligrams of iron a day. Females need 18 milligrams of iron per day. If you're pregnant, you need 27 milligrams of iron per day. And if you're breastfeeding, you need nine milligrams of iron. The vegetables that are high in iron, lots of greens and beans. So beans like black eyed peas, kidney beans, pinto beans, and then greens like asparagus, Brussels sprout, arugula, kale, artichokes. For measurements of specifically how much iron are in the fruits and vegetables that I'm listing, you can check the description below and it'll tell you how much you need to eat. Now to help with the absorption, we're gonna pair some of these vegetables and fruits that are high in iron with some vegetables and fruits that are high in vitamin C. Oranges, tangerines, lemons, blueberries, strawberries, mangoes, pineapple, a decent amount of fruits have vitamin C in it. And believe it or not, even some of the fruits and vegetables that are high in iron are also high in vitamin C. So sometimes when you're eating, you are taking care of two things with one thing. The vegetables that are high in vitamin C are kale, 
there's an example, kale is high in iron, kale is also high in vitamin C. And then we have things like bell peppers, broccoli, again, Brussels sprouts. Now the question is, what in the heck arena are we supposed to do with all of this food? We can do certain things for breakfast, like I mentioned with oatmeal. We can do oatmeal with raisins, bananas, strawberries, honey, and cinnamon, and drink it with a glass of orange juice. We're getting the iron from the oatmeal and the raisins. We are adding the vitamin C to it via the strawberry and the glass of orange juice. For lunch, we can do something like a salmon burger, super high in omega-3s. A lot of people like to cook salmon with lemon. So lemon is the vitamin C, salmon is the iron, and then we can put that on a salad or even make a side of tomatoes with kale and broccoli and onions and sweet potato fries. I mean, you know, make it creative, make it your own. For dinner, we can do something like kohlrabi with broccoli, bell peppers, kale, Brussels sprouts, kind of like a vegetable medley mix. We can cook it all together, top it with some super flavorful black eyed peas. Even do a side of meat of your choice. Some people like to eat smoothies. We can do a watermelon, banana, strawberry, pineapple smoothie. If you're looking for a refreshing midday snack, you can always chop up a bunch of spinach, top it off with some tomatoes, peppers, olives, pumpkin seed, homemade oil and vinegar dressing. If you're not really too much into seeds and nuts, you can go with chicken or beans. Like this video to keep the learning spreading to different people. For more solution-based content, subscribe with the notification bell so you can have access to the future videos. For more on iron and vitamin C specifically, as well as some essentials for inflammation, you can check out this video right here. All in all, if you take one of these ideas and implement it into your life every single day, you're one step closer to taking control of not only your life, but yourself and your mind and your health. And that's what we're after after all, guys. So congratulations. See you in the next video.